everybody. Uh, Lisa T here. I was worried in our contest announcement for Base to Base with Lisa and Glenn that I was a little confusing in the video and um, I went back and watched it and it's a little bit confusing. So I thought maybe I'll do a sample for you just so you know what we're looking for. Um, first of all, got a little bit of feedback. Um, five minutes is not quite enough time. Uh, we thought it was, but uh, so you have, we'll, we'll make it 10 minutes instead. And, you know, the, my worry was that if we had several entries and uh, <laughs> they were all really long, that we would not be able to really, uh, to watch everybody. So, uh, but 10 minutes I think is fine. That's plenty. Okay, so uh, the contest rules are basically you got to head over to base to base with Lisa and Glenn and subscribe. That's the whole point. We want to get 100 subscribers because honestly, <laughs> because I want to make a custom URL. <laughs> and they, YouTube doesn't let you unless you have 100 subscriptions. Okay, so we need to get to the 100 marks so that we can uh, customize our uh, our link there. Uh, we know it's going to take time to build an audience and we're okay with that, but I really want that customized URL. So trying to get to a hundred. So, uh, head over there and subscribe. Uh, then you select one of the following basis, um, Jack Bruce, who, uh, we just covered and we are going to be uploading later on today. Uh, next week, Marcus Miller, uh, famous, uh, jazz bassist who played with Miles Davis and many, many others. Um, Victor Wooten of the Wooten brothers out of Nashville, uh, who's, uh, you know, I mean, he's just brilliant. A lot of non bass players have not heard of him. Uh, anybody who knows bass though, knows who Victor Wooten is and he is totally worth checking out. I, you know, if I were going to enter, I would choose him probably, but, and then the fourth, uh, Miss Carol Kay, uh, you know, she's, uh, part of the, uh, they've been dubbed the wrecking crew. I uh, highly recommend that documentary. It is on YouTube for free. If you'd like to watch it and find out a little bit more about Carol Kay and who she is. So you select, uh, one of those, uh, one of those bass players and, uh, you tell us, uh, something that you learned about them. And then uh, you, you know, listen to a little bit of their music and tell us who, you know, what your favorite song that featured their bass playing was. You don't have to be a bass aficionado. You don't even have to know exactly, you know, the terminology or, you know, you could just say, man, I just really love the way that sounded. You know, it had a great rhythm to it. So I think that's my favorite song of theirs. That's fine enough. And then you tie it to something that you have in your own collection that uh, maybe that uh, the music that you heard from them uh, just reminds you of somebody in your collection and uh, pull it out, show it to us and tell us why. So, um, and then you have to go to the comment on the video on base to base with Lisa and Glenn and let us know that you entered so that we can, you know, find your video. So if let's just, uh, like a, a short sample entry, okay, it would be, um, you know, like I'm going to do Marcus Miller, okay? So uh, so I researched Marcus Miller, and um, I found out that, he, you know, that he's worked with many jazz musicians, uh, Herbie Hancock, Miles Davis, uh, George Benson, and also Grover Washington Jr., Okay, now I happen to have this in my collection, but say you don't have anything from them in your collection, that is fine. But I happen to have this, and um, my, uh, although I love all of his work that I've heard so far, I have to say my favorite, uh, my favorite bass playing from him is on the, sh is on the song, Just the Two of Us. Okay from the album Wine Light by Grover Washington Jr. You know, superb vocal from Bill Withers. Love that song. That groove reminds me of an album in my collection. 
and I've so I've, I've I know I keep showing you guys Frazy Ford. I'm going to keep doing it until uh, you know more people learn about her. But uh, it reminded me of this Frazy Ford album. This uh, there's a great song on this album uh, called Purple and Brown. And I can really hear the influence of Marcus Miller on the bass player on this album. His name is Darren Paris. D-A-R-R-E-N-P-A-R-R-I-S. And he is an incredible bass player from Canada. Ta-da! That was it. And uh, so uh, you have 10 minutes to do it. Um so that, uh, you know, just so we can make sure and watch all of the videos. The contest is going on through March 31st. We have prizes specific to each of the bass players, uh, whichever one you cover. That's the prize that you are uh, going to be in the drawing for. You can do all four of them if you want. You just have to do a separate video for each of them. We are making playlists for each bass player, uh, for each con for contest entries for each bass player. Uh, we currently have one entry from the awesome Robert Hagerman, who we adore. He's a good friend of ours, and he chose Jack Bruce. And uh, so uh, head over to Bass to Bass with Lisa and Glenn, and you can uh, check out Robert's video. It's on the it's on our playlist, and make sure you give him a thumbs up and you know and a comment. And uh, we have a grand prize that everybody is eligible for. That one will not be chosen at random. Um, that one is uh, going to be chosen by Glenn and I. And the prize, of course, is the uh, awesome. Uh, I could have planned this a little better. Hang on. Getty Lee's Big Beautiful Book of Bass. This is my personal copy that was one of my Christmas gifts from my uh, husband, Tony. But let me, sh let me show you the brand new one that we're giving away. Here's the brand new one that we're giving away, okay? And you can see it's still in shrink wrap. Got the hype sticker on it. It's a gorgeous book. It weighs a ton. It weighs nine, it weighs nine pounds. But it, it just it feels so much heavier than that. But anyway, so like for, for Marcus Miller, we're giving away two LPs. One of them is an LP with, a, or no, excuse me, one LP and one seven inch. Uh, the LP is a, a Miles Davis LP. It's a surprise. We'll be announcing it when we do our video. Um, next uh, next week on the 11th and also a uh, 45 of Marcus Miller's um, from his solo work um, that's in pristine condition and it's a collector's item and for uh, Victor Wooten we're going to be doing DVDs for Carol Kay you're going to love that package that is going to be a combination of a CD and a DVD and an LP okay uh, for Jack Bruce, we are giving away a CD of his, uh, of his uh, post cream work. Okay, so uh, I'm going to put the link to our original contest announcement in this video. Make sure you head over to our base channel and subscribe. Watch the video. Read the description, please, because there's a lot of extra information in there that'll be very helpful to you. And the whole point is like the whole point of our base channel. Glenn and I are not experts by any means. We are on a journey to learn more and we want other people to go on that journey with us so that we're all learning together. So this contest is designed to teach everybody something. You're going to learn about a new bass player you've never heard of, or maybe you've heard of them and didn't know a lot about them. And we're going to learn something from you. We're hoping that you dig up stuff that we don't know about. So, oh, I should mention, too, that uh, the person who wins the book, um, the bass player from their album and their collection that they tie to one of the bass players that, you know, we want you to talk about, 
Um, like for instance, how I tied it to Darren Paris. If I were the winner, Darren Paris would be uh, would get an episode uh, all all to himself, and that will air on April eighth. Just as an example, I am not actually entering the contest though, so we want you to enter, and we want to cover your bass player on April eighth. Okay. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope that this uh, cleared things up a little bit. Uh, shout out to the Funk Hall of Fame and Museum here in Dayton, Ohio. And I got my mug. Love them. They have a YouTube channel if you want to search for them and give them a follow. Love you guys. Bye-bye.